Hi, I'd like to show you Hypothesis. It's, um, I found it a really useful tool, and you may too. There are many annotation softwares, but I've chosen this one because it helps to get students to think about how they can add their voice to the public domain. And in fact, there are many documents that are already annotated via Hypothesis. Um, and I'm just showing you one now. This is a group that I'm clicking on now that is for my doctorate students who are in higher education studies. I asked them if they wanted to contribute um, to this video and they asked instead if I could rather show my own comments that they're not yet confident. You can see that if you click on one of the links it will take you directly to a resource that's um, available online and you can share those via various forums. Um, groups can be framed in a particular way with um, particular tags that they can click on which is quite nice for sorting and members are invited via a link. So it's quite easy to get into it and quite easy to see all the various comments that one has made on all sorts of text following a tag or one specific one. Here I've gone to where it can be seen in context and I'm showing you the various ways in which one can edit, delete or reply and how you can link all sorts of other things to that text. Um, quite nice for creating a sort of nexus of interactions um, around a particular text or resource. And of course, it needn't be a PDF. So that was a really brief um, glimpse into the ways in which I use Hypothesis. Unfortunately, um, with many of my students being professionals at this stage, they prefer the private function, which I couldn't which I could show you, but I couldn't quite show you their comments on. Um, I think, though, what this does indicate is how students can be very anxious around a text and around their interpretations and discussions, and how um, a resource such as this allows them to have private discussions, in a sense, both with themselves, if they choose to post to their own records, or with each other, and gives them the agency to create groups um, separate from you, which are still focused on online resources and discussions. I hope you find this of value. Thank you.